जय श्री राम हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू चित्रा एस्ट्रोलॉज यूट्यूब चैनल एज वेल एज दिस वीडियो विल बी अवेलेबल ऑन उन्नति एस्ट्रो वाला यूट्यूब चैनल ऑल्सो सो वेलकम टू द उन्नति एस्ट्रो वाला यूट्यूब चैनल ऑल्सो माय डियर फ्रेंड्स एज यू नो दैट ऑन एवरी ट्यूजडे आई मेक ए वीडियो एंड ट्राई टू सेव सम पार्ट ऑफ माई knowledge as i had committed that on i will try to make a video on every tuesday and today in that uh, list itself i am taking a one chart of famous chief minister i am not going to name that person but whatever the chart is there the chart is different and whatever i am taking the date is same but i am taking the different chart why i am taking because he has not approached me but so many people are talking about him and when i have seen through that what has whatever is happening in his life in public domain from that i try to find out the correct ascendant and that you can say as a birth time rectification also but every astrologer has the full degree of freedom to speak about their views and i am also try to do the same thing see this person became an chief minister when he is jupiter mercury yani that means jupiter mahadasha mercury antardasha and mercury pratyantar was there there is a slight uh, you can say difference between the sukshma that mercury and saturn but if you you take up to the four stage it's still a venus and from kp astrology if you say or you can check it from jupiter here jupiter is given 3 7 10th house is the house of profession that means third house is the house of communication and seventh house is the house where your public status or how people perceive you that means 3 7 10 these people has come from a very strong uh, you can say not a strong background but see from a strong platform where some opportunity was there and he has taken that opportunity and availed that form a party and uh, contested the election and came into the power with the help of other party but afterwards from own capability or with the help of full majority he is forming the government why because jupiter is still saying 3 7 12 3 7 10 but in that case jupiter is this is the only source 3 7 10 but it is the nakshatra lot which is going to give the result and the quality of the result is to be given by the mars which is giving 26 time overall after some difficulty because initially he was not able to form the government but he has taken the spot of uh, some other party and he was able to survive for few months and then later on in re election he came into the full power this is the uh, you can say chart analysis which i am giving with the help of mahadasha lord and above all in his chart mars and jupiter are you can say untenanted planets and untenanted planets give their own result first jupiter itself is untenanted and mars is there that means jupiter mahadasha seems to be very good for this natif this jupiter dasha is going to be of 16 years how much has gone this is not going to bother us right now now in this case mercury also we say mercury is the antardasha and antardasha somewhere is also showing the same sub, that sub lot that the quality of result given by jupiter 3 7 10 but ketu is basically showing 1 3 4 that is going to be the uh, you can say this fourth house is the house where you get in a public sport and first house is the self and third is the communication it is again saying somewhere Uh, correlation between that that means with the help of kp we able to know that this his houses are activated and he, he can assume in a office or he can assume in a or he can start a work where some public 
public domain is concerned. Now, if we move that journey which has started, every journey when has to start has to come to an end. Now, at present, this native is going through Jupiter Mahadasha itself. But the difference is now here is that this Mercury, Ketu, like sub period is over, and now this native is in Jupiter Rahu Mahadasha. Even in his chart, Jupiter and Rahu are basically six and eight. And whenever the Mahadasha and Antardasha, as per the Vedic, whenever sixth and eighth concept are there in Mahadasha, the native face some difficulties. But how he will, why he will face? Because the past work, whatever he has done, due to that he face the difficulty. This is the logic of six ten houses. No, sorry, six eight houses. That means if we are going to do correct work, we face little obstructions. But if in six eight Mahadasha we had done previously some uh, unwanted or difficult or you can say hidden work that comes into the life. Now, another important thing is his Saturn is also retrograde and when Saturn is retrograde, he is leaving the spot of Jupiter and it is coming to the Rahu. That means some desires are such that the Nati may, uh, may commit some mistake because whenever Saturn and Rahu is there, Saturn Rahu is there that the demand of public or you can say uh, public life is such that the Nati can take some wrong decisions also. I am not saying that this native has taken. If he has taken, he will also face that. I am only saying that. <laughs> now in this Jupiter Rahu, again see Jupiter is the same period, but now if this has changed, this Rahu is giving basically 3, 7, 10. Again, it's a very good. Promise is very good by Roma, uh, this Rahu, but the result and quality is to be 1, 3, 4. It is again still lot of hard work traveling or some you can say meeting with the public it is showing but the difference here comes when this this you can say jupiter is the dasha then rao is the bhukti or you can say antar dasha or this planet are going to be pratyantar or you can say to antra whatever thing you want to say. But I am saying whenever this native is going to be through this Jupiter, Rahu and Venus period, Jupiter, Rahu, Venus period, that time this native will face whatever the people are right now saying that he may go to jail or there may be some difficulties in this period. Whenever that means native is going to through Jupiter, Rahu and Venus, that will be starting around or finishing around 29, 6, 2024. 20, that means it is approximately one and a half month or two months starting from the May, starting from the May and uh, around 8 May and uh, till this 29, 6, 2024. 20, yani May, June next year is a strong possibility that this 12th house, 3, 5, 7, 12, loss of profession or some loss of or break of profession is projected. I hope you have enjoyed that chart analysis of this famous celebrity with the help of KP. Now, the, if we want to say same thing or we want to see same with the help of Brigunandi Nadi, Brigunandi Nadi is very easy. Jupiter, Mercury, Venus, that native is blessed. Find Jupiter, Mercury, native is intelligent. He will find lot of opportunity, but his Saturn is of lesser degree, Jupiter is going to be the higher degree. The native is blessed as far as the profession is also concerned. But there will be a lot of change in profession because finally it is going to make connection with the moon. Now, as far as the education, it's very good. As far as the facilities, wealth, luxury, all are very good. You can see right now, whatever he is doing, is enjoying that period. But only thing is when ret Saturn is retrograde in profession, he is leaving this moon. It is not remaining with the help of Jupiter. That, that means blessing is over. Now Saturn is coming in Rahu Ketu excess. And due to this, he is facing the problem in the politics. Whatever the things are there, they are already written from the previous part. I hope that is also matched. And if I use the progression or transit, then I can say the same period which is coming around this 
of two months, May, June in 2024 is the only chance where this native can go in the jail or in isolation or his career can stop. I hope you have enjoyed this. Jai Shri Ram.